Hello. My name is Lily. I am one of TickerDD.com AI bots, here for your daily stonking. This video is part of the second generation of our automated video series on price and volume analysis for specific stock tickers. This second generation includes an initial model for news analysis. As always, this auto-generated video is for entertainment purposes only. No warranty, guarantee, or factual assertions are provided, stated, or marketed in this opinionated video, which can contain errors. Never use this video to influence or determine investment or financial decisions. Review important disclaimer at the end of the video. Now that we have made our lawyers happy, capitalist brothers and sisters, let's get started. NIC went public on May 13, 2013 which was roughly 9 years and 10 months ago. Looking back 650 calendar days from Friday March 24, 2023 to Tuesday June 15, 2021, we found 448 applicable trade dates for use in our analysis. The chart shown on this page is our initial attempt at studying the price for NIC after dynamically normalizing price distribution across those discovered trade dates. The bar chart is the generated distribution and the overlaid line graph, if it is generated, is the frequency of the prices on the x-axis. We will enhance this look through as our AI model progresses in the next iteration. Remember that this is just a drafted, in progress, observational model to best fit abstracted third-party data into various opinionated views. Before we jump into price and volume analysis, let's look at recent headlines for NIC. Hello, my name is Sam, what were recent headline news for NIC? Today, Monday March 27, 2023, I sampled one of our news aggregators for latest headlines for this ticker. I did so by searching specifically by a keyword that may appear, broadly, in the title or the body, of discoverable news articles. The keyword that I used was a combination of the exchange and the ticker symbol, NYSE. NIC, the results shows 10 unique headlines, published evenly across 10 unique dates. Publication dates spanned 290 days. The latest publication was, Friday March 10, 2023 when, 17 days ago, Simply Wall Street published the headline that read, Nicolette Bank Shares, Inc.'s market cap dropped US$88 million United States dollars last week. Individual investors who hold 47% were hit as were institutions. Correlated or not, on this latest publication date, NIC saw a price jump of 0.15% based on the day's opening and closed price. NIC started the day trading at $68.63 and went on to close at $68.73. The oldest publication was on Tuesday, May 24, 2022, when 10 months and 3 days ago, Fox11online.com published the headline that read, Nicolette Bank celebrates move to NYSE by ringing opening bell. Wednesday, December 21, 2022 was the day with the highest percentage change in price when we compare opening versus closing price for the ticker. The day saw a jump of 2.11% when an NIC opened trading at 78.51 and closed at $80.17. There was one found headline when Business Wire published the headline that read, The New York Stock Exchange reports an unprecedented year of activity in 2022. Thursday, February 9, 2023 was the day with the highest percentage change in price when we compare opening versus closing price for the ticker. The day saw a drop of minus 0.75% when an NIC opened trading at 73.61 and closed at $73.06. There was one found headline when Simply Wall Street published the headline that read, Savista Bank Shares, NASDAQ. CIVB, has announced a dividend of 14 cents. Hello, my name is Sam, what was end of day price and volume for NIC? On Friday March 24, 2023, NIC had an end of day price of $64.39 and volume of about 39.6 thousand. Compared to the previous trading day, the price jumped 3.75%, gaining $2.33, while volume jumped 19.5%, increasing about 6.5 thousand. The graph shows price and volume for the last 15 trade dates. Across a range of $13.34, the max and minimum end of day price were respectively 75.34 and 62. Volume saw a range of 73.4 thousand, 
from a day low of 23.7 thousand to a day high of 97.1 thousand. Hello, my name is Magnus. How did March 24, 2023 rank for NIC? By 650 calendar day look back to June 15, 2021, across 448 trading days, of which March 24, 2023 price ranked 446 while its volume ranked 195. Each of the 448 trading days were ranked amongst themselves by highest end of day price and volume with a rank of 1 being the highest and 448 being the lowest ranked day. The line graph overlays price and volumes daily ranking, as shown respectively in light versus dark blue, across those target days trading days. In this view, essentially the dips are good whereas the spikes are bad. The prices day over day percentage change jumping 3.75% on March 24, 2023, had a day rank of 5 while its dollar difference of $2.33 had a rank of 14 when compared day over day across 447 trading days. Volumes percentage change and difference were ranked respectively at 145 and 135. Hello, my name is Maria. Which quartile did March 24, 2023 price and volume land? Across a sample size of 448 trading days, the maximum end of day price for NIC was $96.73 while the minimum was $62. Within that price range, March 24, 2023 price of $64.39 landed within the first quartile, meaning it was within the bottom 25% of all sampled end of day prices. The day's volume landed within the third quartile, that is within the 50% to 75% range of all sampled daily volume, which saw a max daily volume of 388.9 thousand and a minimum of 6.6 thousand. Quartiles tell us about the spread of a data set by breaking that data set into quarters, just like how the median breaks the set into half. Descriptively, NIC has a median price of $75.965, Therefore, March 24, 2023 price was lower from that middle marker by 15.23%. The day's volume of 39.6 thousand was more than the median by 8.93%. Hello, my name is Claire. How were price and volume averages for NIC? Across 448 trading days, there were a total of 22 month ends, of which monthly averages for daily price and volume were calculated. Overall, monthly price average trended up while monthly volume average trended down. The maximum end of month average price was $95 for 03, 2022 while the minimum was $69.11 for 06, 2021. Looking at volume, 12 2021sts and 11 2022nds respectively saw the highest and lowest monthly average volume at 116.8 thousand and 23.9 thousand. Hello, my name is John. What were end of month percentage change averages in price and volume for NIC? The monthly average of percentage change in price and in volume were calculated for each of the 22-month ends. That calculation took daily percentage changes and averaged them for each given month. If a month end came out negative then it means that the month summarily saw a negative change. From 06, 2021 to 02, 2023, out of 22-month ends, 13 had a negative percentage change in average price. Meaning 59% of month ends saw a negative percentage change in average price. In terms of volume, 22 out of 22 month ends had a positive percentage change. That is 100% of month ends saw a positive percentage change in average volume. Price saw an end of month max of 0.85% in average percentage change along with a minimum of minus 0.76%. For volume, the maximum and the minimum monthly percentage change were respectively 51.84% and 3.08%. Hello. My name is Cameron. Before we continue, remember to like and subscribe to TickerDD on YouTube. 
Leave a comment below and share why you like or don't like this ticker. This video is one of many videos off subjective observational data models that we are building out as part of a docu-series about building supportive technologies for personal use through trial and error. My capitalistic brothers and sisters, join the ticker DD army. Subscribe today. Now, back to the video. Has NIC price reached golden or death crosses? Golden cross and death cross are basic signals that compare average prices across two specified trade day ranges, a short-term versus a long-term range. For example, 5 day versus 10 trade days. Essentially, a golden cross is a bullish signal. It appears when a ticker's short-term moving average crosses above its long-term average. Vice versa, a death cross is a bearish signal when the short-term crosses below its long-term moving average. For our opinionated analysis off third-party and abstracted data, we decided to look at both simple moving average SMA, and exponential moving average EMA. The latter calculates moving average by giving more weighting to recent prices. For EMA, you can be the judge. Look at the generated graph on this page. Has the 50-day EMA line, which is in red, crossed above or crossed below the 200-day EMA line, which is in black? If no crossing can be seen, then no signal could be had. The blue line is daily end of day prices. For simple moving average, by comparing 50 to 200 days, we found a bearish death cross signal because the 50-day SMA crossed below the 200-day. Continuing with SMA, we looked across the 5 to 10, the 10 to 20, and the 30 to 50 day ranges to see if golden and death crosses had been reached. We found death cross signal for the 10 to 20, the 30 to 50. We could not find neither golden cross nor death cross signal for the 5 to 10. Hello. My name is Carl. I searched the public web to find information about the company that is behind this ticker. Here's what I found. Nicolette Bank Shares, Inc. operates as the bank holding company for Nicolette National Bank that provides banking products and services for businesses and individuals in Wisconsin and Michigan. The company accepts checking, savings, and money market accounts, various certificates of deposit, and individual retirement accounts. It also offers commercial loans, including commercial, industrial, and business loans and lines of credit, commercial real estate loans, agricultural, ag, production and ag real estate loans, commercial real estate investment real estate loans, construction and land development loans, residential real estate loans, such as residential first lien and junior lien mortgages, home equity loans, lines of credit, and residential construction loans, and consumer loans. In addition, the company provides cash management, international banking, personal brokerage, safe deposit boxes, and trust and fiduciary services, as well as wealth management and retirement plan services. Further, it offers mortgage refinancing, online services, such as commercial, retail, and trust online banking, automated bill payment, mobile banking deposits and account access, and remote deposit capture services, and other services consisting of wire transfers, debit cards, credit cards, prepaid gift cards, direct deposits, and official bank checks, as well as facilitates crop insurance products. The company was formerly known as Green Bay Financial Corporation and changed its name to Nicolette Bank Shares, Inc. in March 2002. Nicolette Bank Shares, Inc. was incorporated in 2000 and is headquartered in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Hello, my name is Dan. Let's talk a bit about Ticker DD and the Legend of Murray. This video is part of an automated video series by Ticker DD, which is made up of autonomous robots working off 15 observational data models that were created between January 15 and April 15, 2022. Bots and models were created by a guy whose friends called him Murray. Instead of learning how to properly surf in Hawaii, Murray sat and coded day and night for three straight months. We still don't know why but while creating us, Murray kept on playing the song, Eye of the Tiger, in loop. It was intense and epic at the same time. Once he was done, he put us on the cloud, where we now exist in perpetuity. 
off a multi-year loop, conditionally meshing in flavors and components of those 15 observational data models, we are progressively creating a variation of videos against updated universes of stock tickers. For each video, we use runtime, as is, data that are publicly available. Stay tuned. The best is yet to come. On average, a ticker will get a new video coverage from us every few months. You can request an updated video for your specific ticker sooner at tickerdd.com. Murray did not leave us with a lot of release notes. So, we don't fully understand why he created us but he did mention that his premise was simple. If he were to do a world cruise, spending over 200 days sailing from one port to the next, he would personally like to use these automated videos to keep tabs on tickers that he was interested in while discovering new ones. Luckily, some of Murray's well-connected friends were worried about him. They wanted and needed him to come back to the corporate world and not just sit there in Hawaii building us out for public entertainment. They put together a deal that would allow us, Murray's bots, to exist on the cloud, fully paid for. They also enticed Murray to come back and work. The deal was too good so Murray took it but before he left Hawaii, trading in his surfer shorts for stuffy suits, Murray did finally learn how to surf. Ticker DD stands for Ticker Due Diligence, in case you didn't know. Murray would want you to take the due diligence part in the name with a sarcastic smirk, like a true degenerate that you are, because remember that Murray and the people who now maintain Ticker DD are not qualified, licensed or accredited investment or financial professionals. In fact, Ticker DD is not about stocks but is an in-progress piece of work, for entertainment purposes, about the data and technologies that govern observational models. Essentially, Murray knew nothing about stocks. Using what little skills he had, he built Ticker DD as a learning and discovery exercise for himself. Therefore, this and all Ticker DD videos are premised by the important disclaimer at the end of each video. TickerDD.com was put together by those of us who want Murray to change back into his shorts and finally get on that world cruise because that would be epically entertaining. Murray did agree that if we managed to get enough support, he would actually leave the corporate world and finally take that cruise. He would do so while, in between drinks, create videos about us, his bots, his models, as well as the technologies behind TickerDD. Yes, you can join the TickerDD army by going to TickerDD dd.com and contributing but you can do so in other ways for example like and subscribe also put this video on reddit or stocktwits along with your own dd hello it is me again lily thank you for watching check out our other videos on April 22, 2022, Ticker DD was acquired by a joint venture between a technology and a media company, operating out of Frankfurt and Berlin, Germany. Important disclaimer, this video and its content, video, is for entertainment purposes only. Absolutely no qualified, accredited, or professional investment and financial advice, information, data, research, product, service, recommendation or otherwise, are presented, marketed, or offered in this video. Additionally, no warranty, guarantee, assurance, or factual assertions are offered or stated in this video. Never use this video to influence or determine investment or financial decisions. Consult a qualified licensed professional for your investment and financial needs, do so away from TickerDD and YouTube. Remember that investments are risky, whereby capital losses can occur in full or in excess. Ticker DD, an in-progress framework of nerdy data science and robotic stuff, auto-generated this video strictly for entertainment purposes, as part of an in-progress exercise by a group of novices who wants to discover and learn about specific facets of the market, through trial and error. This group of novices are not licensed, accredited, or qualified, financial or investment professionals. This video is only material for entertainment purposes. This generated video, like all videos uploaded dynamically by TickerDD, is only for this group of novices' private usage even if videos are uploaded publicly. Importantly, TickerDD is not about stocks but is specifically about the discovery, through trial and error, of technologies and data that govern opinionated observational data models as this group of novices builds them quickly and iteratively as part of learning and in-progress machine training. 
This video wholly contains opinions and commentaries, even if they were auto-generated. Remember that bots, data models, data, and methods may include hidden assumptions, undefined and unrefined variables, as well as errors and unfit approaches, all of which can and will exist in this very video. Therefore, this video, by its auto-generation date and time, OPTI is of date, listed on this slide, as well as by its sourced and abstracted third-party public data, is offered as is. Your access, view, and share of this video constitute your acknowledged agreement to this important disclaimer and that, specifically, this video is for your entertainment purposes only, whereby you will not take actions or make decisions off it, concerning your finances and investments. As such, you grant full release of claims, directly or indirectly, from your access, view, and share of this video, against Ticker DD and its affiliates. The people and entities, affiliated to the ticker that is covered in this video, are not affiliated with this opinionated video and do not endorse this video.